According to the FBI, 19-year-old Mohammed Osman Mohammed, a Somali-born U.S. citizen, planned to detonate a van he thought was packed with explosives that would have caused mass casualties. Unbeknownst to Mohammed, the FBI had been following him for months and had given him a fake bomb. After parking the van in the crowded square, Mohammed moved several blocks away to dial a cell phone to detonate the van. That was the moment the FBI was waiting for. A signal was given uh, from the undercover operatives to the arrest team and the arrest team moved in. Neighbors of the teenager were shocked when they heard about the bomb plot. You're leaving I'm this I'm moving out, yes. <laughs> Definitely, of... yes. Why? His mother is my neighbor and that is terrifying to me, to know that that sort of thing could happen next to my family. Once I recognized who he was, I was like, wow, you know, it's just kind of a surprise that he would do something like that because he just seemed like your average kid. You know? Investigators who've been monitoring Muhammad's email since 2009 saw a very different side of the teenager. It is necessary to train, he wrote on one jihadist website, in order to damage the enemies of Allah as much as possible. He demonstrated from very early on a uh, serious committed determination to commit violent jihad. As Muhammad allegedly developed his plot in Portland with the undercover agents, they reminded him there would be many women and children at the tree lighting ceremony. But this did not deter him. It's going to be a fireworks show, he told them, a spectacular show. New York Times will give it two thumbs up. There has already been some apparent backlash here. Muhammad had been enrolled at Oregon State in Corvallis, 90 miles south of Portland. Last night, an Islamic center there where he went to pray was partially destroyed by fire. Police say they suspect arson. The imam there, who knew Muhammad, said he couldn't believe the charges. With regards to his character and manner, I would never have expected he would even attempt such a thing or even think of such a thing. It is worth pointing out that it was a tip-off from a member of Portland's Muslim community that first got the FBI interest in Muhammad. Tomorrow he appears here in federal court charged with attempting to use a weapon of mass destruction. Terry McCarthy in Portland. Thanks a lot.